Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for July. So this could happen at any time in July. We're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for Aquarius? Now keep in mind that not every reading is for you. Okay, this reading may or may not be for you. Oh, there we go, another one. Okay, bread, period of prosperity and abundance. So you are going to have a period of prosperity and abundance in July. I, psychic ability, trust your intuition. So trust your intuition. Your intuition's going to pay off, okay? It's going to bring you to this prosperity and abundance. And I just picked up the deck, and I know that I had this for Virgo, but I just looked on the bottom, increase in money. So anyhow, um, yeah. So what do we have for Aquarius? Ooh. It's time to move on. It's time to move on from something, Aquarius. You probably know what it is. You might need to get out your boxing gloves. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe you do. Maybe you need to hang them up. Could go either way. Let's get one more card. What do we have for Aquarius? It is time to move on from something. You know what it is. I know that you do. Um, oh. I can't make this shit up. Increase in money. So you are going to have an increase in money. I'm going to show you what's on the bottom again because I feel the need. They have serious regrets for hurting you. Somebody has serious regrets for hurting you. You probably know who that person is as well. So, you know, your intuition is obviously pretty strong right now because that I card came out. Um, so what do we have for Aquarius? Somebody has serious regrets for hurting you. It is time to move on. You know who this person is. Um, your intuition is on high. Um, July is going to be a prosperous month for you. Two of coins, two of pentacles. So two of pentacles is about juggling. It's about balancing, balancing the books. You may need to balance your books, rebalance your finances. Make sure that you're not spending money on things that you don't need. Um, this is also making a choice where, you, where you're going to go next. What are you going to do? You probably have a lot of people that are after you. You've been you know, handling things quite well, but things are probably a little chaotic in your life. You have a lot on your plate. Um, you're probably being pulled in many, many, many different directions. Um, you probably have to make some choices as to which way that you want to go. It feels like you are highly sought after at this time. People are probably, you probably got all kinds of people after you wanting this, wanting that, that kind of thing. You're just like being pulled in all different kinds of directions by the looks of things. And you probably need to find some balance Maybe you need to slow down a little bit. You probably would like to slow down, but you can't. Maybe you're focusing on your money and you're trying to make that money and you're trying to focus it on everything else in life as well. And that's why things just seem a little overwhelmed. Um, maybe that's why you're a little overwhelmed. You just got so much on your plate. I feel like you're really being pulled in all different kinds of directions. Um, but you're really focusing on your money as well. So... I think life is a little busy right now. You're handling it though. You are handling it. There might be something that you need to move on from that is costing you money. All right. What do we have for Aquarius? You have a psychic ability. For some of you, you have a psychic ability that can help you to increase your prosperity. All right. Listen to your gut at all times. That's where how you're going to get your money. Okay. By following your gut. Chariot. Chariot. Now remember, it's interesting because I just said it's time to move on. 
This is about moving on. This is about getting in the driver's seat, taking charge, taking the lead, traveling, going someplace. It is, and look what's on the bottom, the high priestess. You are going places. You are definitely going places. You are highly, highly, highly intuitive at this time. Some of you may also be dealing with somebody that is a healer, that is a psychic, a medium, tarot reader, whatever, or you could be a tarot reader, psychic, medium, that kind of energy. This is a healing energy, going within, listening to your gut. Really listen to your gut. You are headed towards success. The chariot drives you towards success. This may have something to do with a car or a vehicle, traveling, getting on the road. There could also be somebody that is coming towards you, that is driving towards you, that is traveling towards you. Could be a Cancer, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Either way, you're really going to need to listen to your gut during this time. Listen to your intuition that is going to drive you in the right direction, okay? You are headed in the right direction. You're headed towards success, whatever it is. You're, it's almost like you're the boss. You're the leader. You're, you're in control. You are in control this month. Um, you are headed right towards success. Moving towards success. Three of Swords, Reverse. Now, this is on the path to recovery. This is a healing, forgiving energy. Um, leaving the past hurts behind. Oh, King of Swords, that is your energy. Very, very intelligent, very uh, direct, very honest. You're probably going to be... Uh, oh, you're going to have to use your your head. You're going to have to use your head in making some sort of decision that you need to make. You're going to be put in a tough position. You are. You're going to be put in some sort of tough position where you have to be a judge. You have to really, really, really use your head. Use your, use your intellect. Um, somebody is, I think that somebody is headed towards you. Maybe it's somebody that hurt you. Because we had that card that said they have a lot of regrets for hurting you. So I'm wondering if there's somebody that is headed towards you. You've got opposition ahead because of the, the on the chariot, the opposition. But you're, you're in a position of power. You've got the sword of power. So you are in a position of power. Five of Swords reverse. There is somebody that is headed towards you that betrayed you, that hurt you, that stepped on you, that walked on you, that did not treat you well. Page of Pentacles, Sun card, three of three of Pentacles reversed, Eight of Pentacles reversed, and Nine of Cups reversed. And then we have the Empress energy. This is the birth of a new life, creating a new life. Um, a blessing. A blessing is coming. It's time. It's time for some sort of delivery. You are about to get a delivery. Some of you could also be, uh, there could be a pregnancy here. Um, but this is the birth of a new life, creating a new life. We have a creator here that is creating a new life. There is happiness in your future. You are in a position of power. Uh, I feel like there's deep fulfillment that has co is coming. A lot of deep fulfillment. Even for some of you, there's news of a new, another child. Okay, I think I already said that. But whatever is happening, it is very, very, very happy news. This is a new opportunity, a new prospect, a new endeavor, a new project. Whatever it is, you have a new opportunity here. You're probably going to be focusing on something new. Uh... Going down a new path, a very middle card is the Page of Pentacles. That is a golden opportunity. It is an offer. So I feel, I honestly feel like you're. This is going to be easy for you. Uh, I feel like you're receiving an offer from somebody, and I don't know if it's a business proposal or it's somebody that has really, really hurt you in the past. Because we have the Five of Swords reverse next to the Page of Pentacles, so this is somebody that has betrayed you. Or, that's what it looks like. Could be a new opportunity with the Page of Pentacles. But there's forgiveness here. Somebody has really, really, really hurt you. And this is an apology. I think you're getting an apology from somebody, Aquarius. This person uh, may not have communicated for a while. Maybe it's like three years. Something about three years ago. Something, maybe it happened three years ago. They didn't put in effort. They've got the... They uh, were very, very arrogant, egotistical. This person was uh, 
shallow, um, lazy, they uh, may have pushed you away, they pushed you away, they, they wanted to win at all costs. You're dealing, you, you've got somebody in your past that has a really, really big ego that doesn't work well with others. Um, <coughs> I feel like this person has now been hurt. They've been hurt very, very badly. Um, and now they want to say something to you and you're going to be like, are you kidding me? You know, that you may be in shock. I don't even need the tower card to say that. I feel like you're going to be in shock. You are definitely creating a new life. You have an opportunity to start over this page of pentacles that is starting over or to start a new endeavor, start a new project, broaden your horizons. Um, <clears throat> whoever is coming forward is wishing, they are wishing that they never hurt you. Damn it. That's just like that card says. They wish that they didn't hurt you. They wish that they would have put in more effort. They wish that they could take it all back. And I don't say that lightly. I don't ever say this shit, just so you know. Um, this is this is somebody that sees your beauty. They see your value. They see your abundance. Um, and they want they want to make you. They're gonna they're stepping forward. This is somebody who has found their moral backbone to do the right thing. They have been suffering. They have been grieving over the loss of you, and they're coming your, in your direction. There is a, this could also be somebody brand new. Okay, this could be the birth of, like I said, the birth of a new life. There is somebody that is coming towards you that uh, is real. This is a real solid opportunity. It's not going to be easy. It's going to be work, but um, I feel it can lead to a bright, bright, bright new beginning. We have the Sun card, extreme happiness. This is happy news. Page of Pentacles and the Sun card. Pages are messengers, so this is news. It's happy news. Really, 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 really happy news. Um, you are headed right towards victory, and somebody else is headed towards you with a proposition. This person um, sees your ability. They see your ability to follow through. They see your ability to, to deliver. They see, they see your abundance. They see something in you that uh, they want to be a part of. So yeah, you're going to be receiving an offer from somebody. Um, this person, whoever this person is, may have ignored your skills because... They didn't. They were. They were jealous of you, or they wanted to be in a leadership position. You know, they didn't want you to, you know, surpass them in some way. Now, this could be job related. It could be. This is this is bliss, complete bliss, deep fulfillment. You're about. You're going to receive some sort of blessing. This is a gift. It is a gift. This is the end of some sort of suffering. It is with the three of swords reversed. This is on the path to recovery. But you're going to have to be logical and you're going to have to make a decision. You're going to have to make a decision about your future happiness. This is somebody, I, you, know, I, I, you know, some of you, it could be somebody new with that page of pentacles. It could be, but I, I, I don't think it is. I think it's somebody that you know. I feel like it is somebody that has stomped on you, that has pushed you away. This person is a, has a very, very, very big ego. They like to be the boss. They like to be in charge. And I feel like the fact that you stick up for yourself and you are so authentic and honest and uh, forthright, I think that was the problem. Um, but I do see the birth of a new life. I see, I see it's time. It's time for you to receive your blessing. It's time for you to receive your reward in some way. Um, somebody, somebody did not see, they did not see, um, they, they may not have thought that, you, that your hard work was going to pay off. You know what I mean? They may not have thought that you were that valuable or something like that. Where's the love in this reading? <clears throat> You are moving towards success and somebody is headed right towards you. I feel like you're going to be in the spotlight. 
as well. You're shining, you're glowing with the Sun and the Empress card. That is a glowing energy. You're shining, you're in the spotlight. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Unplanned. Six of Pentacles reversed. Unplanned loss. We have a fraud. We have a con here. A financial setback. Not receiving what you deserve. This person sees that you they didn't give you what you deserve. You didn't deserve this. We have something here where there's a lack of teamwork, there's a lack of togetherness, something isn't working out. We have an individual that is a glutton, and this person is unhealthy, they uh, are selfish, they are arrogant, they are shallow, they're not practical, they're not realistic, there's a lack of reciprocation, there's no equality. You could be letting go of, you have to make a choice, obviously, with that two of coins. That two of coins is a choice. All twos are choices. Which one do you want? Where are you going to, what are you going to do? Are you going to take this one? You know, he's literally got it in two hands. What's it going to be? Is it going to be this one or this one? This one? You definitely need to make a choice. You're going to be forced to make some sort of freaking choice. Where? Which way are you going to go? Can't have both. Can't do both. Some of you may need to start over on some sort of diet plan, just saying. That just came to me out of nowhere. You know, some of you may need to f um, focus on your food. You may need to get realigned with your food, starting over, starting on a new endeavor, starting on a new project, starting on a new uh, diet plan. <laughs> I don't know where that's coming from, but you need to eat healthy. Especially when you're creating a new life. This is about eating healthy. We have the sun card and the empress. That's health. That's health. Good health. And better health. Your health will be increasing if you can follow through. The page of pentacles is about follow through. It's not easy. And maybe you've been slacking. I don't know who needs to hear this. Somebody has been slacking in the food department. You know, you need to take charge. You need to find willpower and discipline. Okay? So some of you need, somebody needs to hear this. Somebody hasn't been putting in much effort into their health. They need to focus on their health. That's part of it. That's part of success. If you want all-time success, you've got to focus on your health. And you probably are going to be focusing on your health. Somebody has definitely been overdoing it. They've been eating too much. <laughs> Sorry. I don't, I don't think I've ever said that ever in a reading. I don't know. Anyhow, it could be somebody that you're dealing with. Um, there's a need to focus on your health. Um, I do see you finding a lot of discipline this month. You are really taking control of your life in some way. You're moving towards success. You're moving away from some sort of situation. And I think that's why it comes around. You, there's always a test. You, you start to be successful. You start to take the, be in charge. You, you get to a place where you're shining and you get tested. You're going to be receiving some challenging information. Could be about your health. This may be what makes you focus on your health. The Empress is a goddess. She's a goddess of love, right? She's abundance. That is love. That's unconditional love. So you do have love. You do have love here. That's unconditional love. Could be self-love. Now we have the Page of Pentacles reversed. Now that is a dead end. <coughs> Dropping out of something. Not putting in effort. We have greed here. You know, I feel like you have somebody around you that isn't giving you what you need. They're taking from you. They're costing you money. There's somebody here that is, this person is lazy. I 
don't know, maybe it's a child. Maybe you need to maybe you need to cut them off financially. I don't know if that's the case, but that's the sword that cuts. We definitely have somebody here that is taking more than they're giving. They're unstable. They're not practical. There's also, there's also like, I don't know if it's greed, theft, fraud, con, uh, not committed, no commitment. There could be an unplanned loss of a job here or something like that. Or you could be telling somebody no. You, you, well, obviously if there's a choice, somebody's going to hear the word no. We get the page of pentacles upright and the page of pentacles reverse is somebody may be you know making you an offer and you I'm sorry but I don't I don't have anything to give you you know the empress is the queen of she's the queen of all queens but she's also knows her value she's very very valuable everybody loves the empress and helps the empress and wants to you know be around the empress because she radiates love so I'm, something is going on here you are in a very beautiful position, put it that way. You are going to be receiving something. This is a golden opportunity that is going to make you very, very happy. Could I, For some reason, I want to say rich. I don't know why. Anyhow, um, you, some of you may be receiving a gift of a child. I don't know where this child's coming from, but, you know, hey. Or it has to do with a child. Um, we do have somebody here that is not healthy, that isn't doing what they said they were going to do. You know, somebody could be moving, I don't know, somebody's moving in with you. Or somebody is moving, they're moving something to do with a mother. Could have something to do with children and, and mothers. Could also have to do with children and fathers. There could also be a decision that is made by a judge with that uh, king of swords. Whatever is happen happening, there is movement, okay? And it, it is good, it, I think it's good, I do. Somebody is leaving behind a very tense situation where they have been extremely controlled. There's no teamwork, there's no togetherness, there's no compromise, there's no working with somebody. Somebody has not done what they said they were going to do. And they're losing, they're losing, and maybe they're losing you. Anyhow. Knight of Cups reversed. Jeez, Knight of Cups reversed. That is not looking for a relationship. I don't want to be in a relationship with you. So, I don't know. You may be dealing with a womanizer or some, or uh, if you are a man, this could be a, a woman that isn't committed, doesn't really want commitment. Knight of Cups next to the Page of Pentacles reversed. This person, when, the, when it gets rough, this person doesn't just bah, lose his focus. Okay, this person has no staying power. I think that you are going to be receiving an offer from somebody. I think you have two offers or two opportunities. If it's not offers, it's opportunities. You have an opportunity with somebody that has no staying power, and then you have an opportunity with somebody that does. You're also receiving a gift. This is a breakthrough. It is a bright new day. It's a new beginning. It is a, it, something is happening where you have to make a decision and the, whatever the decision is that you make, it is a good decision. This is good. It's, it's ha you're going to be happy because you're in the position where you get to make the decision, you know? I think that you're going to be holding on to something. You're going to be, maybe you should hold on to what you got.
you're definitely going to see an increase in money. There's no doubt about it. I think you are able to handle conflict and chaos and uh, bullshit pretty well. You have somebody that doesn't have good intentions that is going to be propositioning you. Use your intuition because that's what we started this out with. This person probably is having financial problems. They uh, are struggling financially and that's why they're coming back around. So I don't know if it's a child or it's an ex or who this person is, but be careful. Good luck.